The township was badly damaged by fire this morning. Heavy smoke and flames could be seen pouring from the building. When firefighters got the fire under control, all that was left was a burned out shell. Lisa Washington explains what happened. A fire chief told us that firefighters from eight different fire departments were called to the scene to help put out the flames at this home. The fire chief says this is a two story home. Part of the second floor collapsed as firefighters were putting out the flames. It didn't take firefighters in Westmoreland County long to put out the fire at the home on Charles Hawk Drive Tuesday morning. When we got on scene, fire was shooting out all the upstairs windows already through the roof. The first floor was uh, heavily involved. They used water and foam to prevent the fire from rekindling. We were very lucky. We have a hydrant right in front of the house over there, so we were able to establish a quick water supply and knock down the fire quickly. Once the flames were out, firefighters searched the home to make sure no one was inside. A fire chief says there was a woman who sometimes lives there. She wasn't at home when the fire started around 5 a.m. The fire chief doesn't believe the fire is suspicious. I believe a neighbor called it in. They come outside and saw, saw uh, the house on fire. I called the state police fire marshal uh, just to yeah, inspect it. At this time, we're not looking at anything suspicious. As for the large number of firefighters who were on the scene, the chief says that was done to ensure they had the resources they needed. Our rule is we'd rather have people coming and send them back than need them and have to wait for them. Lisa Washington, KDKA TV News.